Hello everyone. So I'm going to give you some tips and ideas for designing a swimming pool. The most important space is where the swimming pool is, with the spectator seats. This space will most likely need a long distance panning system because there can't be any columns blocking the vision of the spectators as well as the pool can't have any columns. It will also need a lot of sunlight and fresh air but privacy at the same time. It wouldn't be so comfortable for the swimmers if they were visible to the outside. So the envelope of the space has to satisfy all needs. Then we've got spaces that the athletes have to go through before entering the swimming pool area. These spaces need to be organised in a sequence and in a way that there's no other way for the athletes to go. There can't be a way for any athletes to cheat and skip them. There will be the administration and staff spaces also connected to the swimming pool area. So the entrance for each group of people comes down to your design and how you organise these spaces. They might each have a separate entrance or a single entrance that splits, that, sp that splits into three directions. Keep in mind that in every design, you're designing and defining the path and the journey that the user is going to take. So the rest of the design, how these spaces are put together, would depend on the site it's built for. So let's say there's a big space surrounded by many smaller spaces but it still needs sunlight. A good solution for this is the height difference. If this has a bigger height than the rest there will be an opportunity for light and air penetration through both walls and roof. And the height here also shows that this is the most important area in the building. Everything else is a path leading to this. I hope these few tips would be helpful for you to start your design process. Any questions, leave them in the comments section and thank you for watching.